So now let's take this sticking combinations idea that we just had in the last tune a step further. This is something called the octopus. And essentially what we're going to put together here is a one bar pattern that utilizes 22 different sound sources on the kit. So it's essentially the same concept as we just had in that we're going to take a particular sticking pattern and break it up around the different sound sources. But in this case, we're also going to bring in some of the multi-pedal stuff as well. So let's look at the groove first from the ground up, so to speak, by checking out what the feet will be doing. We'll have three sound sources covered with the left foot as I place the left foot halfway between the hi-hat and the cowbell. And then I have one of these LP jingle rings on top of the hat to give us that third sound source there because ladies and gentlemen this is a matter of quantity here all right uh, for the right foot we have the kick drum and the outside china hat there the distortion hat going on and essentially the part will be quarter notes on the left foot and kind of a latin feel on the right foot the feet part will be this all right now with the right hand we're going to come over and use the ride cymbal, the uh, auxiliary hats here, the mini hats, and the signature series V-Wave over here. Uh, and with our sticking pattern, we'll be able to catch the ride cymbal with the floor tom and the mini hat with the bridge drum and then end up with the V-Wave over here. So as we do just that sticking with the right hand, it would go like this. Okay, now with the left hand, while that's going on, we're going to catch the timbali, the 12-inch rack, the snare, and finish on the 10-inch rack. So we'd have this just with the left hand. So as you can see, what we're basically doing is taking the idea we had last time of the doubles and splitting them up between sound sources. Now when you put the right hand part and the left hand part together for this first half of the octopus, it would sound like this. All right, now for the second half of the groove here. We're going to start up here on the 22 China, catch the cymbal disc, and then the cowbell. That part would go like this with the feet. All right, now our left hand part will be considerably more busier over here. We'll have the jam block and the ridge rider. We'll have the 10 inch timbali and the 13 snare finishing up on the 14 inch bridge drum over here. Just the left hand part for the second half of the octopus. So now when we put the right hand part with that left hand part for the second half, it would sound like this. So finally, when we take that original right and left hand parts that we did there, the first half, combine it with the second half that you just heard there, we'll have a one bar pattern that utilizes 22 different sound sources. All together, it sounds like this. Mm -hmm. 